Howdy folks, welcome to episode 15. Today we're going to do some more adventuring and so yeah, I just slept in the beds, it allowed me to sleep again. And so yeah, for those of you who didn't get to see the bonus episode, I did a 14 and 3 quarters and we came back to here and I bought some pentaxid and so we just bought some more because it allowed me to sleep. And I also bought some medium armor and some more boosters and that stuff and so yeah i was able to to basically um get the stuff that i needed i got a bunch of plastic too i bought a bunch of plastic and so basically we are pretty much decked out with the plastic let me see if this guy has more pizzas because my goal is to no he didn't refresh on the pizzas yet okay my goal is to basically eat nothing but pizza in this in this game and I'm, it's going to take a bit before I get to that point, but I think it'll be kind of fun to do that. Basically, it's going to be one of our goals is to get to the point where we can make our own pizzas out of our farm. And so the other thing I did, as you see here, is I painted. And I also I also upgraded the, the stuff to combat steel. So if you look here, see it's all combat steel. So yeah, it's all upgraded to combat steel now. Um, except a few of the outside trim blocks are not, but yeah, the the hull, all the stuff that seals the hull up, is now combat steel. So, yeah, so we're better protected for that. And let me see here. Let's do this. Turn on our gravity generator. And the other thing I did was I organized all of the ores and everything. And so yeah, I went through and organized the. Oh, and I need to put that stuff back in there too but yeah I went through and organized the the constructor and I think let me see if we go to here I should be able to so if you look here after I added on the combat still it used to be 17 and 14 I believe and now it's 14 and 11 so yeah we're probably going to need to upgrade the engines this ship is going to go through some some uh upgrades Let's see we can fill that all the way up we can fill that all the way up I think we already did, yeah, okay. But yeah, this ship is gonna go through some upgrades and everything as we continue to do things. And let me see, I put, I had night vision, let me see. There it is, okay. I just wanted to keep that on me in case I uh, need it for whatever reason, temporarily. I don't plan on using it for anything long-term, but, and actually, I think we can turn this back off. Here we go. We don't need the gravity generator on because we're right next to the to the thingy. And let me see. I think we're actually going to go up to the big cockpit here, to the big captain's chair, and we're going to take off. So the goal here, now that we've pretty much entered the um, the newer phase, the exploration, you know, planetary explanation exploration <laughs> phase of the game is the goal is that we're just going to go like look at all this stuff and see what all is out there so i think we're going to go to this and then we'll go like there there and then we'll have to come back here to there and i think we've been there and then we could go down here and see what else is down here so we're going to head to here first and we're probably going to do a bunch of warping here and we'll see what is at the station, if anything. Yeah, I'm definitely going to need more engines on this thing because they are just... <laughs> it just feels really sluggish right now. But at least it's not using a ton of fuel. So there is an admin here, right? Yep, there's an admin. Okay. And this must be um, a... We'll see if it's a safe zone or not. I guess we'll find out soon enough, huh? But yeah, we're going to head to the admin and... Let me see, while that's happening, I'm going to make sure my turrets are set up correctly because I do want to do, let me see, we're going to do like this. I'm going to do this old trick and hopefully this will keep it from firing at stuff I don't, most of the stuff I don't want it to fire at. <laughs> and let me see, so that's just predators, yeah. Okay, so those shouldn't be shooting at anything other than, other than that. So, yeah, we'll let those go. How far away is this thing? Let me see. Let's set a waypoint. See how far it is. It's six, six kilometers. All right, I'll meet you there in just a second. 
Okay, so is it just me, or does this say that the space features an asteroid belt? Do you see an asteroid belt? I don't see an asteroid belt anywhere. I don't see one anywhere. Okay. <laughs> it's not just me, right? All right, so I want to make sure that, let's see, make sure that we don't ram into this, for one thing. Is this the big, this almost looks like, um, no, it isn't, okay. I was going to say it almost looks like the other one, the hostile one, but... And, you know, the other thing we need to do here is we do need to make... I, I almost forgot about this. We do need to make, make... We'll go into the constructor. Let's see. Go into the constructor, and we're going to make a... We're going to make a repair bay. Where is it? Repair bay. And we can make the repair bay tier 2. And we're going to make the repair console. And so we're going to set those up too, so that we can, um, yeah, we're going to set those up so that we can uh, repair our ships and stuff when, we, when they land. So I think we're just going to park the, the CV here. And let's see. Let's see which way we're going out that way. Okay. Let me double check and see if that's done. Nope. It's still... Wow, it's it's slow even on the fast crafting mode. I don't even want to know how slow it is on the other one. Okay, so yeah, we're going to head up here, and we're going to go check out the thing while we're waiting. See if maybe anybody else has Pentaxa to sell, right? <laughs> All right, so let's see. Control, bedrooms, garden, sickbay, teleporter, trading. Okay. And we'll grab some free oxygen while we're here. Too bad you can't grab free fuel, right? Okay. Let's see. Teleport offline. Yeah. I'm sure those don't go anywhere in this anyway. They haven't I don't think they've got the um that stuff set back up yet, the teleporters, because the solar systems are now random. Let's see. We have Market Cafe. We can get some pizzas. We're gonna buy nine of those. There we go. And see is there anybody else that's selling nope nobody else selling stuff here now the other thing is and it's kind of exploitive to be honest but right now you can um you can sell the the boosters you can sell the eva boosters that you can make and they sell for like six thousand each so i mean you can make a ton of money just making evas and it's not the only one let's see we're gonna buy that we're gonna buy five of those there we go. But it's not the only uh, it's not the only type of thing that you can do with that sell the buy sell kind of economy thing um, to get a ton of money. There are other things like weapons and stuff. You can you can craft weapons yourself and then sell them to these guys. See, like for ridiculous amounts of money. And so you could sell two of those and five of the tier two rocket launchers and all that stuff. And so yeah, it's it's kind of I don't know. They need to do something with that. Let me see, how many of these can we buy, right? We can buy 30, yeah, and let's see, there we go, okay. So we have more Pentaxid, that's all I want, is I want to keep buying Pentaxid until we can run into an actual source, because we do need to have a bunch of it to go exploring and everything. Um, I could use 22 more of those. So yeah, see you can make an EVA. I can sell five of those EVA boots for five thousand each. So I think we're gonna check out who else is down here. Oh, that's it. Okay, that's actually everything. So we're gonna go back up. Now again, I I think I mentioned this before. You can um, what is this? The tiny little the tiny little observation room. You can. Uh, you can hold down your, okay, the teleporter's deactivated. I don't think you can open this. No, it's just, yeah, it's admin locked too. But when you're going up and down the elevators, you can actually run on the elevators and it'll go faster. Just an FYI. Let's see. So yeah, if you, if you don't like spending 20 minutes in the elevator, especially on those things where the elevator's really long, you don't have to um, spend as much time still do have to spend some so while that repair bay is going we're going to craft let me see there are here 
the EVA boosters. Where are they? There we go. So we're going to craft five of those, which is what we said they have. And we can go out here and let me see. We're going to move this ship. There we go. And we can put the repair bay right there. So we're going to put the repair bay. Did I make a... I made a base repair bay? Or is it that you can only make the tier 2 repair bay for bases? Let me see. Let me see what that the deal is with that. Let me check it out. Let's go into the the tech tree here and check and see. This is the one thing the tech tree is actually good for. Is is showing what stuff is made out of and and that kind of thing. Uh, let's see. Repair bay, repair bay tier 2. Okay, it shows yeah, there's one for the CV and there's one for the base, apparently, because that's placeable CV. I did not know that they were separate thingies. Okay, so we'll just, I mean, we've got tons of Zesco CM in a restroom. Let's see, we're going to go CV, and we're going to do the repair bay tier 2. Now, the console is for both, so we don't need to make the other console. That's fine. But yeah, we can let that craft. This only made one of them. Did I... Did I use up my gold somewhere? I know I had a ton of... I had like a whole ton of gold ore. Didn't I? Didn't I mined up like an entire thing? Let me see. Let's see what we have as far as the extra ores. That's Sathium. Did I really... Did I use all of the gold ore making that stuff? Okay. I guess so. Hmm, okay. All right, that's going to be interesting. So I'm going to have to find another source of gold if I'm going to make those things. I can make, um, as you saw, I can make the Tier 2 rocket launchers. Let me see. The Tier 1 and the Tier 2. So I can make two of those and um, one, two, three, four. I think it, it said I could make. I mean, this is going to make me a ton of money right there. So, yeah. Um, <laughs> let's see. What is it doing? Oh, it's using those to make the other ones. Okay, it's using the tier ones to make the tier twos. <laughs> nice. That's nice. Okay. So let me see. I, I, yeah, I think four tier twos will be just fine. But apparently we don't have the gold to do it. I swear I had a lot more gold than that. Okay. I must have. I must have. Uh, you know, moved a decimal or some mundane detail, right? It's always a mundane detail. Uh, 248362 dollars and fifty eight cents is not a mundane detail. Right? Okay, so we're gonna place this thing. We're gonna place this. There we go. That was a weird pause there. Okay, we're gonna place that there. And did I miss one when I was painting, really? Okay, apparently I missed one. All right, so we're gonna we're gonna paint that too. Now we can put our ship on it, and so we can also do this. Oh no, I don't want to do that in space. That's a really bad idea. It will let you de-dock it in space, and then you'll be stuck trying to. It is really painful trying to dock a hovercraft in space, it, especially if you're not aligned. There we go. Okay, we'll do that when we land. We can we can put a booster on that and go do that stuff. But for right now, we're just going to go down here and do our trading that we need to do to get more Pentaxid. Since they make... I wouldn't do this, but they make Pentaxid like such a pain to get. Um, let me see. And so... What was this guy again? That's the Market Cafe. Okay. Let's see. It was these guys over here. So I think this is the one that's, yeah, rocket launcher. So we can sell them for 18000 So yeah, there we go. <laughs> we have money again. And I think, did he, was he buying the EVA boosts? No, he's not. Okay, this guy buys them. So he's going to buy the EVA boost, sell. And then we're going to buy the Pentaxid. 22. There we go. 
whoops, I just bought Promethium. Totally meant to do that. <laughs> so is it it okay, I was gonna I was gonna ask if it lets you over over uh run that number, but it doesn't. Oh, I can buy gold here. See look, I can buy gold for two hundred and fifty for an ingot. <laughs> and then I can make EVAs. So let's buy twenty ingots. Okay. And then we can make <laughs> we can make EVAs with it. And I, no, I'm not going to sit here and do that for hours or whatever. Um, I I just wanted to do to get enough money. Was that the? Yeah, there it is. I just wanted to get enough money to buy the stuff that I wanted to buy. I'm not going to like park here and and buy stuff for hours or whatever. All right. I'm glad this game is not made so that you have to do that to get around. Um, and let's see. We're gonna go up the stairs here. Maybe we should just walk up the stairs, right? Why is that door open? Who left the door open? You know, let the cats out. Okay, let's go here, and we're gonna take off. So it looks like it looks like the ship. Let me see. Where's the repair bay? Where is the repair bay? Here we go. This is uses. It uses 20 idle. Let's see what the idle is. 403. 403. Okay, so the repair bay doesn't use any idle. That's nice. That's good. I don't have to waste my time turning it off then. Okay, so I think that's it for this. I don't see anything else. I don't even see the, the so-called asteroid field. And let's see if we opened up any new warp lanes here. Yes, we did. Okay, so we've already been over on this side. So I think we're going to try, maybe we can end up just going like that, because we haven't gone to Untormen yet. We're going to go to this one, and we're going to see what's there. And let me see. There we go. So yeah, we're going to see what's over here. If it gets there. <laughs> there we go. We're going to turn auto brake off. And what is here? Magnesium and Promethium. Okay. And let's see. Let's do this. This is a barren planet. This has a bunch of stuff. Now, I need copper. That has Pentaxid. I'm sure it's the tiny little... It has Pentaxid. <laughs> Deposits. Right? And let me see. I'm sure they're in a van down by the river, right? Um, let me see if we can find... I want to look at the map again. This has magnesium and promethium. Yeah, I'd, it's not even worth looking for stuff that's in orbit. It's, just, it's really annoying. And I am half tempted to come up with some pretend device that will... Um, that will act as a scanner, you know, and you craft that and then it'll reveal the places as I type map into the console. But yeah, I think we're going to take, I don't want to take the CV down. So we're going to do this and we're going to take the ship. You know what I need to do? And somebody suggested this is I do need to make a, we're going to make like a stairway that goes up this way and out here and out of the ship to the back so that you can go out there from the upper bridge. I think that would be cool. We'll put another armored door or whatever. But yeah, let's see what we've got here. We'll take our ship down. We haven't gone to the barren planets yet. And you know what? I didn't even check to see if I have oxygen or fuel or anything. It's like, is there air? You don't know. <laughs> okay, so let's, let's see. Um, are those, is that, that texture just looked weird there. Okay. Let's see. We're going to, we're going to get oxygen and put the pentaxid away too. I don't want to bring all of our supply of pentaxid with us. So let me see here. We can do, what I also did is I moved these consoles into this group so that every time I come into there, they're right there. So we need some oxygen. We can put the pentaxid away and... I'm going to bring these with me just in case I need them. If we find something quick that I can just grab, that's fine. Let me put those away. Don't need those. 
Don't need those. I'm going to bring some fuel with me and oxygen. And do I have enough ammo? I have enough ammo. Okay. And we have a detector. All right. I think we are good for, I don't even have a pistol that uses those. So we're going to put this stuff away too. We're going to end up messing around with the repair bay once we actually need it. So, and I will show you guys how that, how that works and everything. We can put down the repair console and, and all that fun stuff and do a, um, do the repair bay thing. But yeah, so we have fuel and oxygen and ammo and all that. Yeah. So I think we're good to go. So let's go, let's go explore the planet. Enough of this. We're going to go explore. And let me see, we are at the sunset again. Yeah. We're on the west. Assuming this is right side up. Yeah. We're on the west side. Is this going to be a green planet? It's, is it going to be green the whole time? Let's see what we've got. Here we go. And I think we're going to start heading toward daylight. And let's see if there's any POIs or shooties or anything. Let's see, we can turn off. I don't want to turn off auto brake yet. Let's get. Let's just get close to the ground so we can see what these things are. I think those are just tree billboards. <clears throat> tree sprites. Yeah, they are. Okay. And come on. Ugh. Are those rocks floating above the ground? Oh, it's those. Okay. Okay. This, I like how they all look exactly identical, too. It'd be cool if they had, like, a whole biome filled with those, where there was some kind of natural phenomena that created that. But <laughs> when all of them are exactly identical, it kind of doesn't have the same effect but yeah we're gonna fly around here what is this what is the temperature where we're at we're at negative 12 oh the other thing I did was I bought medium armor and I put the multi boosters in it so we are doing a lot better with that and you know I didn't bring food so I'm gonna have to make sure I I'm gonna have to make sure I have um, enough food Let's see there's neodymium Iron, Sathium, Promethium. Okay. I don't think there's anything we're going to stop to mine. And I think those are just the deco. Yeah, see, they're not dancing. And, you, know, you can see here, I want to show you guys. We'll stop for a second here. You can see these aren't dancing. These are not the ones you can pick. So just, just an FYI. Those are not the ones that you can pick. They are just, they're very similar looking, but they're just deco pieces. And I'm not sure if they even give you logs when you break them or what, but there's plant protein. Lots of plant protein. Let's see. It looks like this thing is going to be northeast of us. Ooh, there's a POI. There's a listening post. I need to get out of the way of that thing. I need to stay out of the way of those things for right now. Listening post is actually kind of small. Um, let me see here. Listening post is a small POI. We could actually go do that. Let me see. Let me see how my ship is doing with statistics. 24 meters per second. Um, yeah, let's let's try this. Let's see if we can see if we can get the listening post. You know what I need to do too? What is our range here? 278. Okay. I need to, uh, it's too bad it's like right in the middle of that open thing too. I need to do this. We're going to go 40 so we can see. And we're going to go run it. Oh, there's some aloe there too. Cool. Or whatever they call it now. But yeah, we're going to see if we can get the, let me see, where are the turrets on that thing? I think they're right there, aren't they? Aren't they right there? Let me see. It is reloaded. Maybe we can get some shine, some sunshine off of them. I think, yeah, there it is. It's right there. Come on. There we go. Oh, I didn't kill it. There we go. Okay, so we got that one. I think that's actually... Whoa, that's all of them. But we do need to... Wow. Oh, that's a plasma drone. That's why. Okay. Who else is shooting us? There's another minigun drone somewhere. Somebody's shooting us. Somebody's machine gunning us. From where? Where was that? Where was the machine gunning coming from? 
Did you guys see it at all? Oh, you know what? I'll bet there's a bunch of dudes on the ground. There's dudes on the ground that we can't see, and we're probably too far away to even see them. Yeah, there they are. They're down there somewhere. I don't think I'm going to be able to get to them. Let me see. That turret right there is just aiming. I can see it turning at me. We're going to go like this. Come on. Stay on target. Oh! Stay on target. Whoa! <laughs> did I tell you? Oh, did I tell you one hit or what? I told you it was a one hit. Oh, man, we are so close. <laughs> oh. Yeah, do not get hit by those. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. Okay. All right, well, we're going to try to... Oh, man. This is going to be fun. We're going to see how much we can do, how much damage we can do here. Come on. See how much damage we can do here before we get killed. Let me see. There's a thing over there. I'm hearing stuff. Let me let me get my FOV back too. <laughs> All right. That's fun. I knew that was gonna happen. All right. I I saw that. I'm like I'm dodging right into that. I saw it in advance. Okay. So we're gonna go. We're gonna get up there. And you know what? There's a patrol. There's a Xerox patrol over there somewhere, too. So we're going to have to deal with that. We're going to have to deal with the Xerox patrol. Oh! And as long as you dodge right after they shoot, you should be good. Oh! Is that... That's... Oh, man, that's mechanoids. That is mechanoids. Okay. So. <laughs> That's awesome. All right. I'm going to have to. I'm going to have to uh, respawn back in. <laughs> uh, what, did, what was that? Um, nearest medic trading station. Your home base. There we go. Okay. On, on orbit. Okay. It said home base. I'm like. It's just. I was looking for CV medical station. So. Yeah. Here we go. <laughs> all right so what do we have here we have just our armor is our armor durability is zero okay i thought so all right so we're gonna have to take the armor off and we're gonna have to build another ship um let me see here we're gonna go we're gonna take this off we're gonna go down here to the repair station and we're gonna put this in here and we're gonna repair it you know what's funny is the repair station doesn't even need to be turned on in order to be used. It's off. If you look in the control panel under the repair station, it's off. So it uses 150 kilowatts to do nothing. That's that's awesome, isn't it? Okay. Well, I guess we didn't waste our food. And I'm glad I put the pentaxid away before I, <laughs> before I decided to uh, go be stupid. But yeah, let's see what we can... Um, I'm trying to decide if I want to bring down the... I'm trying to decide if I want to bring down the hovercraft. Basically, we'll bring down... Let me see. We can do... Can we put in artillery? What does the artillery take? It takes... Which shells? Where are the shells? Artillery shell HV. Okay. So let's see what it says for artillery shell HV. I really wish you could filter these by so we need magnesium powder and three magnesium powder for each shot okay we can do that we can make yeah we can make we can make rounds for that so let's do it let's make the hovercraft um artillery what is the range on that thing the range on it is 850 nice okay so that should get us a good range. Let me see, what is the plasma turret? The minigun turret? Um, trying to decide whether we want to do plasma, rockets, miniguns. Because do we even have a minigun turret on that thing? I don't remember if we even put one on there at all. Let me see. I probably should have done the repair to... 
repaired a console thing before I uh, got that ship shot up, huh? <laughs> We're just going to build another one. We're not going to keep that same ship. We'll just build a new one. Um, let me see here. What was I going to look at here? We don't have a turret on it, is what I was going to look at. So yeah, we're going to take these off, I think, and we're going to put the minigun turret on it. So I'm going to have to make a multi-gun too. All right, let's do this in space because, yeah. <laughs> so we're going to make a minigun turret, I think. Let me see. Weapons and items, minigun turret. And that's what I need to do. I need to make a multi-tool. I think, do I have one? Let me see. Let's go check in here. And I don't have a multi-tool. Extra equipment. No, I guess I don't. Okay. All right, I'm going to grab a tier two multi-tool. Let's see. We're going to make one of those. And I lost all my 30 charges too, didn't I? Okay. So I need to make that and I need to make charges for it. And let me see what else. We need the artillery rounds right we're gonna make those and then we're gonna get the minigun turret the craft minigun turret let me see whoops let me see if we have let's see if we have um any of that stuff no we don't okay we have some plasma but no we don't have the minigun turret okay so I hope it didn't blow up the ammo box. I didn't have anything in the other things, but the ammo was kind of... Uh, it actually wasn't that expensive now, was it? So we're going to do a minigun turret, so that can take out the... Um, we're going to do two of those. That can take out the bad guys, and then we're going to make a bunch of those. Yeah, we're going to make a ton of those. Okay. And did it make both of those minigun turrets, or what? Yeah, it did. Okay. All right, and here. It's almost done anyway, so we'll just wait for it. There we go. Okay, so we're going to put this stuff in here. This is on retrieve blocks, yes. And we can upgrade those now that we've got the good, the good stuff. We can upgrade these to the laser turrets anyway. So, yeah, let's see. We can take... These. Let's put our artillery on here first. Let's see where we're we gonna put that thing. Can we put it up here. I think we're gonna put it up here. Is that centered? I think it's centered. Let's see. Like that. Yeah. Nice. We're gonna put our artillery up there. This thing is just gonna be so ridiculously overloaded with stuff. And then we're gonna put our mini guns here and here. And we could even rotate those poles if we wanted to, but I think they're fine as they are. Might even make two more minigun turrets, because I want those things to just blast the dudes out of the sky as they're, um, you know what I mean? Uh, off the ground, that is. I want to. I want them to blast those dudes. So actually, I think we're going to do that, because that way all four turrets can do hopefully either separate targets or they'll finish them off more quickly. So let's do two more of the minigun turrets. Because we can fit four of those on the ship, right? Maximum. You can even put six if you want. Okay, we're not going to go that far. And let me see. We can put the drills back in there because we don't need those. And we can even make another thousand of these. And let's see here. There we go. We're going to put these up on the top, I think. Like that. And that. Ah, uh, did it? Yeah, it did. <laughs> Let's try this again. One more shot. And then we'll see if we can get the... See if we can get our revenge on these things. Let me see. Yeah. Yeah, we're going to have to put the, the repair bay console down. And why don't we do that now? Let me see. Where did I put that? I think I put it in the extra equipment. So we're going to go... Was it extra equipment? No, it was in the weapons. Yeah. So we're going to put this thing down, and I'll show you guys how this works. Um, let's see. Where do we want to even place this? Do we want to place this? 
I think we could put it right here. That's fine. Okay, so when you go up to this thing, there is nothing on the um, there's nothing on the thing. So yeah, we're actually gonna have to go down to the planet to do it. All right, let's do this. Let's go down to the planet, and yeah, I'll meet you down there in just a second. Okay, we are landing here. We should be we should be okay. Let's see. Let's turn off the thrusters. Save us some fuel. All right, and so what we're going to do is we're going to get out and grab the hovercraft and we're going to put it on that thing. I think we need a hover booster. Let's see. Where's the hover booster? We're gonna put a hover booster on this. And yeah, I know we're going long today, but I think if we're gonna we're gonna get the hover booster on this thing and get this thing. We'll show you the repair to blueprint thingy. So let's see here. Make it like this. Hopefully we don't run into any hostiles, right? Let's see. We can put the hover booster right over there. It's fine. Okay. So just in case this won't just in case this won't be tall enough. Whoops. I wanted to do that. I think it might actually be yeah, it's tall enough. Okay, so when when we park this on here, it should power it off. Is it docked? Or is it that the I don't have feet on the bottom, do I? Okay, I don't have feet on the bottom. Let's go. Let's go put feet on it too. We need to put a foot on it so it can dock underneath. So let's go like this. We'll go hovercraft, devices, foots. Okay, make one foot. We'll place this on here, and we'll get this thing docked. Hopefully, we won't get attacked while we're dinking around here. Right there, we go. We're gonna put that on there. We're gonna. Bring it down, and there we go. Okay, now when we power it off, we should be able to go into this thing. Man, the background sounds are weird. I'm not used to those sounds. Those are new, at least in my experience. Okay, so we're gonna go to the repair bay here, and we should be able to Oh, you know what? I think you do that inside the ship. Yeah, sorry. I've only done this a couple times, so. <laughs> so I'm running around like an idiot. And so you go into the ship. There we go. We can do save template. There we go. All right. And we are at 99%. There should be some. This thing should be repairing it, hopefully, when we turn it on, too. Let's go back here. I know I don't, I don't have any weapons on me or anything. And our backpack should be fine. It shouldn't be, the timer on it should not be running while we're not there. Repair blocks, um, automatic mode. Oh, it's still retrieving repair data. Let's see. Let's see if it comes up with anything. Is it gonna come up with anything? Because we are powered on, right? The repair bay is powered on. Repair bay is powered on. The repair console is on. So what is it doing? What is this doing? Not enough resources. We need zero iron ingots. <laughs> okay. Let's see. We're going to grab some iron. We're going to see what it t says now. Let me see. Do we add the resources in here? There we go. And... Retrieving repair bay. Okay, so start repair. So now it's going to repair the ship. I like how it's you can't do it because there's nothing in there, but it doesn't need anything, it says. Okay, so there we go. 100% of 9895. That's a lot of... That seems like a lot of hit points, doesn't it? Okay. All right, but anyway, that's what you do with that is you set the... Um, you set the... Uh, whatchamacallit here. Did I grab the... I did grab all of those, right? 
there, Hera. I grabbed all of the machine gun. Yeah, all the bullets. Okay. So, yeah, that's going to be it for episode 15. Join me in episode 16. And now that we've done the repair thing and we set our blueprint, we showed you how to do that. So if this one gets damaged, we can repair it more easily. And, yeah, I need to put that block back in, too, <laughs> before I do that. But I'm just going to do that off camera. So in episode 16, we're going to take off with this thing. We're going to go over and see if we can get rid of all of the Xerox resistance, get our backpack, and take out the POI. So, yeah, that's going to be it for 15. Join me in episode 16, and we will see you then. Later.